Hi everybody, Starch Lady here. I tried something a little tricky today. Call it lazy if you'd like. I'll take it. But I was going to make rice in the Black & Decker rice cooker. And I found four potatoes still laying around. And so I threw them in on top and a squash from the garden threw that in on top to see what would happen. And I noticed a couple of very unique things. Number one, as I take this lid off, it's just finished. Nice and hot. Ooh, that's toast, toasty. Look at this. I poked it already, so I wanted to reopen it. But look how soft and perfect that potato is. Absolutely perfect. The squash, same thing, perfect. And the rice is fluffy wuffy. Now that was one cup of rice to two cups of water. And I just put just a little bit of salt in there because rice without salt is weird. But um, nothing rolled over. I normally keep it on this plate because it overflows like almost every single time I do rice. It bubbles over the top. Uh, it started to come up, as you can see, on the lid. It started to steam up just a little bit on the top there, but it didn't overflow. So I'm really excited about that. Now all I have to do is just scoop these little squashes out and the potatoes. Uh, I'm doing a rice mini right now, but I'm the only one here and I have these four other potatoes I thought I better cook them up So they'll be handy to carry in my purse if I need a snack or something later this week because at this stage I don't want to eat them I want to put them in the fridge and make them a resistant starch So that's what I'm gonna do is put them in the fridge overnight And then I'll have them for snacks later if I need them and then I've got this lovely pot of rice that I can have for dinner or I can uh, use for breakfast with a little cinnamon berries on it or something like that. So I've really been impressed with the rice mini. I seem to eat less. I eat slower. have to chew more. And so all in all, I think it's a good deal. I've lost now, what, 12 to 13 pounds on the Mary's mini this first month back on. Uh, a little bit more than that. I'll do the math and I'll tell you about it in class tomorrow. But anyways, it's between 13 and 14 pounds that I've lost for this month. All right. Thanks so much for watching.